In this video, I'm gonna show you how I knit in my ends as I go when I'm doing striped or scrappy socks. Right now, I'm knitting the basic B pattern from my shorty sock set, and I'm doing the scrappy version, and I'm doing five rows of each color. So I'm almost at the end of my fifth row for this pink, and I'm about to start transitioning to the yellow. So I'm gonna show you how I do that. So first, you're gonna take your new color. In my case, it's the yellow and you are going to just kind of drape it over your old color like that. Just kind of loosely, kind of just have it hanging out there. Then you're gonna knit a stitch to secure it. Then you are going to pick up your new color, the yellow, kind of get it tangled there. <clears throat> and you're gonna wrap it around your finger. At first I wrap it around my pinky and then I grab it with my index finger. And you're just going to flick it over your right needle, knit a stitch. Then you're going to knit another stitch, then flick it over, knit, knit a stitch. So you're only flicking it over every other stitch. Over, knit and see how it kind of grabs it on that second stitch after you flicked it and then over now I'm going to move my marker and that's the beginning of my round so now I'm ready to actually start knitting with my new color but we don't want to cut this off because then we'd have to weave that in later so we're going to knit in the end of our old color so grab it the same way and we're going to do the same thing we're going to flick it over and knit with our new color and knit a stitch, flick it over, knit a stitch, and then we're going to flick it over and then knit a stitch. Okay, now we can cut our old color Obviously don't cut the new one. I've done that before. <laughs> like that. And then we just continue knitting in our new color. And as you can see, these stitches are knitted in. And what you wanna do when you finish your whole sock is you'll turn it wrong side out and you'll just kind of give these a little tug. You can see how I need to go back and do that once I finish my sock, but you'll give your ends just a little tug, not too tight because it'll pucker the fabric just enough. And then you'll go and you'll just kind of snip them a little bit closer. You still want to leave a little bit of length so that they don't poke through to the other side. But you'll do that all the way down the sock. Just tug and trim. And that's all you need to do instead of having to weave in all of those little ends. You've knitted them in as you go. So that's how I do that. When I'm doing stripey or scrappy socks, I just knit them in like that as I go. And then in the end, I just pull and trim those ends and I'm done.